Hello guys, my name is Lalit Singh Mehta and today I am going to explain you how to convert megapascal into Newton per mm square. So before going into the conversion, I would like to show you how the hierarchy for the system goes. First, kilo denoted by small k 10 raised to 3 mega denoted by capital M 10 raised to 6 giga denoted by capital G 10 raised to 9 tera denoted by capital T 10 raised to 12 so today we are going to see how to convert this mega pascal into Newton per square. The same method will be applied to all other units also. So suppose for example, we have to convert 100 mega pascal into Newton per mm square. So our aim is to find this value. 100 mega pascal is equal to how much Newton per mm square. So let's start. 100 mega pascal can be written as instead of mega I can write it as 10 raised to 6 Pascal correct instead of mega I have put 10 raised to 6 m Pascal now 1 Pascal is equal to 1 Newton per meter square correct so now 100 into 10 raised to 6 Newton per meter square so now we are getting close to our solution. Now Newton per meter square. Now again, 1 meter is equal to 1000 mm. So instead of meter, I have to write mm. So which is equal to 100 into 10 raised to 6 Newton 1000 square. This will be in mm. So now you can see this 100 into 10 raised to 6 Newton 10 raised to 6 mm square this will be square since it is a square so 10 raised to 6 10 raised to 6 gets cancelled 100 Newton per mm square so this in this way we can convert mega Pascal into Newton per mm square so if you want to convert any of this hierarchy system, we can approach like this. So hope you liked today's lecture. Thank you.